what's up guys welcome back to another video now i've made this video oh i shot this video like three times already but upon reviewing the videos i just didn't like not like how they came out so hopefully this is the final one and this is the one that you guys are watching this video is going to be a gym tour i'm going to give you guys a tour of my gym my home gym or our home gym me and charmaine's home gym it's mostly hers because she's the boss and yeah it's mostly her gym but i'm gonna give you guys a tour a couple people have asked um and a couple people have commented to me personally about how it looks dope in the background of like some other videos that i've done and i told them that i'm gonna do a little gym tour of it so that's what you're gonna see here today guys and i hope you guys enjoy this one and uh stay tuned to check it out Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame Though it might be nice to own a jet plane I'ma do it all for you, come along and see it's true But the world is pretty cold, you might need a sweater too I'ma put a ride on ya, kid from California Trying to make it in life, a school that never taught ya Dreams of my own, I've been working from home I can do it on my own, but sometimes it gets cold Alright, here we go First of all guys I love this screen thing. It's the ones that you see like in the infomercials with the magnets. And I love this thing. I just let it go and it just connects. That is so awesome. I've always wanted one of these and I saw them at grocery outlet of all places. And so I grabbed it. It was like eight bucks or maybe like 12 bucks, 12 bucks, sorry. Uh, but yeah, these are so dope. I love these things. Boom. <laughs> all right, guys, let's get in there. Do you want to come Pepper? Do you want to come? Come on. Pepper is scared to go break through it. He just not, so I have to leave it open. Come on, come, come. Good boy. All right, guys, so here we are, guys. Um, let me turn on the lights here real quick. Got the light switch here. Takes out, boom. Nice and bright. Look at that, love it. By the way, I got the set of four. These are LED lights. Um, I got the set of four for 50 bucks on Amazon. Everything I bought here that I can list um, on Amazon, that I bought on Amazon, I'll list it in the descriptions down below. But yeah, this is it guys. I'll turn on this light too. Here's the home gym guys. Quick look of the home gym. All right, let's start off with this side real quick. We'll start our way here and move our way to the right. So here I got the couch that was in the office before. Uh, we moved it over here because we got that whole new set in the office. Um, it's an Ikea furniture. We've had it for a couple years and it's it's been great. And over here, we got what my friend Erwin says is like the most expensive side table. Well, I don't know if that's the most expensive, but it's a pretty dang expensive side table. It is an old G5 tower. I don't even know if it's operational. I don't even know. I haven't really hooked it up, but I had gotten it a couple years back to fix it up. Never got a chance to. I'm thinking about making it into an editing computer, gutting it out, and you know, just redoing everything. So yeah. So right now it's a it's a side table, and it's perfect. Over here we got the cap bench and this other adjustable bench. Um, this one, you know, the, the weight capacity is about 300, which I didn't know until I bought it and was putting it together then reading the uh, instructions. Yeah, yeah. That's, I, so always read the description before you purchase. Uh, I didn't until I got it, but it's okay. This one has a uh, weight capacity about 660, I believe. And this one's incline. And I like this one because the teeth on here um, feel a lot safer when I, you know, go heavier weights. Just feels a little safer, or a lot safer actually. I'll show you the other bench that I have um, that I don't feel too safe in, but is, is still a good bench. Over here, I got the mirrors. Put up the mirrors. Uh, this is like one of the best things in here. Uh, I think it's awesome. And it just, it just makes the gym like a gym because you gotta have mirrors in the gym. Uh, I opted not to go with the, the bigger ones, be, the taller ones, because it just, I just didn't see the need to get the taller ones besides like the price point was more expensive on the taller ones. And so I just grabbed these ones. 
And over here, I got uh, my three amigos. Uh, they're just sitting there. Uh, I got a whole story about those. I got those at the one show that I did. I plan to get more in the near future. So yeah, but I got a story about that. The, that one was like the best ever. Like first time in my life where I started something and finished it. So, so I'm really proud of those. And over here, I got that double pulley system that I had made a video of. I'm just chilling here right now because I'm going to move it further back so it's closer to the shelf uh, and uh, put another pulley up there because uh, help stop the swing. Uh, I still get a little bit of sway from it since it's connected all the way and it goes all the way straight down. So I get a little lot of sway on it. So if I put another pulley there, it'll reduce the sway. So I'll do that later, but I still use it still great and uh over here i got my dumbbell set right this is like this has been like a long time coming and it all well, yeah a long time coming and a few years building um, and i'm so happy for it i'm waiting to get more I keep bugging my friend to see if the the store that we get it from has more uh, but not yet so right now I go, uh, I have 10, 20s, 30s, 40s, 55, 55 because they didn't have a 50. So I just grabbed the 55 and 60 was the highest that they had at the time. I need to go at least up to a hundred. Um, but if I can get up to 80 right now, which that would be great. That would be perfect. So yeah, that's that. Now about this rack, this actually sold there, there was one that was bigger, which was like double. And in hindsight, I should have just got the double. It was $100 cheaper to get this one. And I didn't think I'd need a bigger one for a while. And now I ended up, you know, needing a bigger one because I'm going to get more dumbbells. And this smaller one, which is kind of annoying that the 40s don't fit in there. So I have to put 140 up there, another 40 down there, which is kind of annoying to me. Um, I don't like that because I'm kind of like OCD when it comes to that. I, I like to have them together. So I, I should have got the bigger one, but this one's okay. Uh, I just get weary about, about how they sit here. The bigger ones sit a little lower. So I'm scared they just drop. So, uh, I, I hate it when pepper, I get really nervous when pepper goes around there. So I never like to have him go around here. I don't like him to go around when I'm working out. I like him to just stay on the couch and which he does for the most part because I, I don't want to like worry about him because he likes to sit close to me. If I'm working on his bench, I'll find him underneath me, like underneath the bench, just chilling. So it's kind of nerve, nerve wracking. Anyway, over here, we got the TV. This was actually in Callie's room. Uh, we moved it out here because we'd gotten her a new TV and I have a uh, Roku hooked up here. Let's see if it'll turn on. There it goes. So I have oh, I have Roku set up right there, so we can just chill and watch TV or have something on, like YouTube music or like you know play some a playlist on there on YouTube, and uh, yeah, work out. I also got Alexa here. Uh, I got a Dot. Sorry, Alexa. Alexa, hi. Hi. Have a good evening. You too. All right, so that's that. So I've got plenty of music to go to go by in the, in the gym, which is awesome. Then I got here our cardio machine, which is our bike, which we love this bike. It, it is awesome. Uh, we got a good deal on it again on Amazon. Uh, I'll link it down below if it's still available. But we got a good deal on that. We got that a few months ago. I had a video on that also, so I can link the video on that and when I put that together. But I love this. And I purposely put it in front of the TV so when I'm on the bike, I can watch YouTube. So that's awesome. And here I finally got a tower to put the, the weights in. It does the job, but it feels like, that doesn't really feel flimsy, but it just feels like it, it's going to buckle, but it's not. It's been really good. And over here, oh, here's the other bench that I was talking about. See how the, the, uh, the teeth, how, how it's in there. And it's just held by that little small piece that's welded on there. And so I get a little weary, but it's, it's actually done a really good job holding it up. But obviously, um, 
I'm just worried like it could just slip if I dump in here, like it just come out, but you know. But it's been, it's, it's done, again, it's done it's, it's a good job. Here, uh, I got Olympic bar and I got my squat rack. This is like the first thing that I got. I replaced my uh, flat bench with. I used to have like a flat bench, but it wasn't really versatile, versatile. Um, so I got this one, the squat rack, so I can do a lot more things to it. And I got my easy curl bar. Got another mirror here that my buddy Tin hooked me up with. Didn't want it, it was just sitting in the garage. I just asked him about it. I was like, hey, look, where'd you get that mirror? And he's like, do you want it? And I'm like, sure. So he dropped it off. So appreciate that. We love the mirror. It's full, full on, full length mirror. So you can see everything. Um, this is another mirror that was we were actually using for a while. This was from our bath, master bathroom when we redid the mirrors in the bathroom. And we took this one out and put new, one, new ones in. And that's Charmaine's uh, little exercise ball. And here is the freaking best thing ever. I bought this in my first purchase on uh, OfferUp. Bought this on OfferUp. It does a whole variety of things. Again, my coach, um, Coach Mike has this one. He said, get this one. This is the best ever. It just does a lot of things. And it's the best. It is the best. And I, it was worth what I paid for it. Um, I didn't even haggle with the guy. I didn't even lowball the guy or anything. I said, you know what? That's a good price. It's in good condition. I'll take it. And he was like, dude, cool, man. Thanks. And so I took it. And I got pretty good. He, he was giving it for a good price. He, he, was, he wasn't trying to rip anyone off. He was giving it for a good price. So I took it. And uh, he was happy that it was going somewhere uh, that was going to utilize it like he was us utilizing it. So worked out on my first offer up. Um, purchase <laughs> so and here we have the treadmill she's been a beast for the longest time she is unfortunately uh, you know in her last leg she is slowly like just retiring so we're looking to getting a new treadmill to replace her because uh, I mean I'm gonna need a treadmill especially if I start getting ready for a show I'm gonna need a, a treadmill for sure um, but again, she, she's given us a lot, she's given us a lot of burned calories, uh, she's, she's been a workhorse. So yeah, definitely gonna be sad when she goes, but hopefully I can get her somewhere, uh, someplace that can repair her and then find her new home. And here there's Pepper. I got, finally got the mats. I finally got mats. I've been wanting new mats for the longest time. I had had those puzzle cube ones or square ones for the longest. And then um, I finally got these mats. What are you doing? Um, these are three fourths inch thick, four by six feet mats. And they weigh about a hundred pounds each. They are not light. Um, I was amazed to even get them to fit in the Venza. It was amazing that they were able to fit 10 sheets. This is 10 full sheets. Uh, I did have to cut a little bit on three of them to make it fit because my garage space is just a little shorter. Uh, but these fit in the Venza, it was crazy. Um, and then I had to offload them myself and put them in their place, the rightful place all by myself, no help. It was a workout. It was great though. It was crazy workout. But now they're on now they're all set and in position in place. And really my like these are like this is what makes it the gym, I think. This and the mirrors really makes it gym. It just adds to the aesthetics of the gym. Uh, even my boy Dennis, when he he and Jake came over to work out. He was like, dude, bro, this is like, it just makes it aesthetically pleasing, like, you know, having this. And for me, I enjoy the smell, the rubber smell. People like complain about, like in reviews about the rubber smell. I don't, I, I mean, to me, it smells like a new gym. It smells new and fresh. And so I really have no problem with it at all. Even with the dumbbells. Most people hate it. I, I actually enjoy it. So yeah, it is been a long time coming guys 
Um, I've been wanting to do this for years and I finally have this whole nice setup that I can utilize 24 seven whenever I want to. Uh, I can take breaks during work and do a few sets and then go back to work and then come back later, do a few more sets. So that is like the most amazing thing about having a home gym. Now we'll, we will add more equipment that we can fit in. Uh, there's a couple things that I want, the leg press and uh, a cable crossover. Those are like the two things I can think of right now that I feel would make this gym complete. For me if we had those two things and we'd be all set and i can fully train and get ready for a show at home and obviously more dumbbells but yeah other than that that is it that is the home gym guys what do you guys think let me know oh i got my picture here that charmaine gave me for i think it was father's day or my birthday last year my birthday and i, I love it it's the best like thing ever um yeah so got that but yeah let me know what you guys think of the new home gym uh i'll post a picture of what it what this space looked like beforehand it's a big old mess um been wanting to clean it up with from all the clutter for a long time and i finally did it and it looks and we love it so yep this is it oh, honey.